there not to love about a Mustang? I mean, I feel like, you know, somebody gave you the keys to the Washington Monument and said, hey, take it for a spin. I think it is the ultimate American airplane. It just represents America. If you think about when it was created in World War II and how short of a time that Americans created this machine that ultimately possibly turned the tide and won the war for us. It just represents American ingenuity and American know-how, and, and it's just a symbol. I mean, it's especially to fighter pilots, it's like apple pie, baseball, and Mustangs. I mean, it doesn't get any more red, white, and blue than, uh, than one of these fine machines. You can just feel the power of that Merlin sitting out there. I go to Reno every year. I've been going for 10 years, and there's no better sound in the world. My wife even said it, you know? She goes, there's nothing cooler than the sound of a Merlin coming by. But it sounds way different from the inside. It sounds like an angry sewing machine, but you can still feel, you know, that horse, that wild Mustang energy. I mean, it's an inanimate object. You know, it's just metal and different kinds of hardware. When it's together, it's beautiful, it smells good, it sounds good, it feels good. But it's definitely an escape. Which is why I'm so uh, impassioned with the thing. The responsibility and the history and the legacy and all of that that comes with this aircraft, you can feel it just by, just by touching it. It's much more graceful than a heavy metal jet aircraft. I mean, it doesn't roll as fast, you don't pull as many Gs, but it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a graceful way to fly. It's not, you know, all heavy hitting, yanking, banking, throwing yourself around. It's an iconic figure. Everybody knows it. Everybody understands it. When you're a little kid, you know, when you buy a toy model, it's a Mustang. Somebody would come up and say, what's it like to fly the Mustang? And my thought is always, you, you don't fly the airplane, you wear this airplane. The Mustang more so than anything. You just sort of slide it on and become one with the airplane. I think what I love about the Mustang is probably what everybody else loves, and that's the sound. You can tell a Mustang from miles away. And all you have to do is hear the Mustang once, and you start a love affair with that plane. It just never ends. It's the sexiest airplane ever made. I mean, it just looks like it's going 500 miles an hour staring at it. So I guess those are the reasons I love it. This is the best way to get off a Mustang. <laughs> you want to know what's cool about a Mustang? Is that Air Force pilots in training are orbiting this airport so that they can take a look at a P-51 Mustang. You know why? Because they know that this is the coolest airplane in the world. Whether it's three of us, two of us, or just a, a solo, is, is really focused around the machine. Most people who go to an air show know what a P-51 is. Many people go to an air show because of a P-51. And it has a very unique sound. It has a very unique appearance. And there's a, a significant amount of history that goes with it. We love this aircraft, and we want people to enjoy it and see how much we care for and respect it.